this is going to be a rather uh, short episode. So there is one or two new things happening in June. Uh, one of the big things is uh, Sea of Thieves. This kind of went under my radar. I knew it was coming to Steam, but I just kind of forgot about the release date, which is June 3rd, which was a few days ago, to be honest. Um, it's actually a pretty fun game. If anything, I would like to say it's similar to Elite Dangerous in the aspects that it is more or less a simulation type game. And it's kind of fun. Um, also, unfortunately, similar to Elite Dangerous, you must play the game cautiously. There are people who are ganking and griefing and who will go out of their way to, you know, kind of ruin your fun in a sense. So always be on the side of caution when playing games like Sea of Thieves or Elite Dangerous. And also Elite Dangerous, there is actually news for that too, which is quite surprising I would like to say. So um, Elite Dangerous, if you see on the screen, um, on the new DLC question mark or new big update coming 2021 is Elite Dangerous Odyssey, Space Lakes and all that kind of stuff. Uh, yeah, I mean, I thought I thought they called it New Era or something, but I guess they changed the name at the last second. So Space Lakes is more or less confirmed, but again, it's not coming out. This year is going to be coming out 2021, but that's about it. Um, controversies aside, uh, revolving around the said trailer, um, I won't go into that, but yeah. Pretty much everything else is the same. Uh, Fleet Carriers, June 9th, Satisfactory, June 8th. You know I'm going to buy and stream that. And Sea of Thieves, surprisingly fun. I didn't know this game was that good, to be honest. But yeah, that's it. Nice and short today. Stay healthy, stay caffeinated, all that good stuff. Have a good one.